death and deformity brought about by failed circumcisions in the country cannot be ignored. However much there is to be admired in the rituals and ceremonies that mark the transition of childhood into manhood. The country continues to record deaths of failed circumcisions following severe complications as a result of direct injuries. A nine-year-old boy in Karomatangi village, Kakamega County, has lost his life while he was undergoing the cut in a private hospital. It is a sad situation that has since left the family in grief after losing their loved one. According to the parents of the innocent nine-year-old boy, their son was among five other children that were waiting to be circumcised, adding that their child started vomiting during the exercise, a situation that might have led to his death, at least according to the doctors. The other members of the family could not hide their pain after losing such a young life. Nikaangalia mtoto nikaona mtoto anajaribu hata kuamka. Tunamshikilia anapenduka mwenyewe na akikaa hata kama unaweza kumuita anaweza kuangalia. Daktari nilipoangalia mtoto daktari akasema endeni nje tusikue watu wengi. Nilibakisha baba yake. Hapo ndio ilikuwa mwisho wa kuonana na mtoto. Baadaye nilisikia mtoto ametuaje. The body of the child has now been taken at Kakamega General Hospital. Asisa nilimpata kwa kisu tena amekufa kwa kisu. Imekuwa kushangaa sana. Kwa sababu amekuwa mtoto mchangamfu, mimi ndio nilitamani sana sisa atairi. Nitoke kwa chapter ya kutairi watoto. Lakini imekuwa maajabu ya kushangaza. Mpotesa mtoto kwa njia ambayo sielewi. This is among many other unreported cases in the country where lives are lost following both circumcisions, raising questions on how well can this be managed to reduce such incidences across the country. Faith Anula, K24, Evening Edition.